Good afternoon, Weeborners. This is Jennifer from Weeborns Nursery, and guess who I've got with me today? Little Mr. Ethan. And he is looking sweet in his red little romper outfit. Um, he's had this on probably for a few weeks or so, maybe three weeks. Um, and I thought it's time to get him changed up into something different. And I had seen um, someone's Ethan on their channel, and it made me want to pick this little guy up with his beautiful blue eyes and um, just change him and spend some time with him. So I'll give you a quick look over of what he has on and his cute little face. But he had on this red romper, short sleeve, um, short you know short pant uh one piece romper and it has a little elephant on it down by the left leg and it's a gray elephant and the actual romper is red with um, dark blue little shapes some of them are little cars some of them are elephants footballs um, stars the word cool uh, I think that's all it has on there, but um, we're going to change him out of this and snap him here a little bit. I hope you guys are all doing well. It's been a beautiful, beautiful day here in Northeast Indiana. Um, went out and put the cushions on my swing outside today. Took a little walk with my dog. Um, went and played tennis with my husband and my son, my youngest son, and now we are just kind of in for the evening. We've had a little bit of supper, and we're going to um, just take it easy. My husband and I, I think we're going to watch some Netflix, so just taking it easy this evening, uh, but I had a question for you all. Okay. Do you only purchase brand new Reborns or silicones or do you buy second hand? And by second hand, I mean you could be the second owner, you could be the third, the fourth, whatever owner. Maybe that baby has been, you know, passed around a little bit. Um, but I, for as far as my collection goes, I can tell you that all of my uh, Reborns, are second hand or more except for Ethan here I believe Ethan when I got him on eBay I believe the seller was the one who created and painted him and then was selling him on her channel and I will look and post below what her name was if I remember if I can find it and then um, what the name of her eBay store is most of my other ones, my two Paradise Gallery styles I got on eBay, Caleb and then Jade were both on eBay. I believe Jade was brand new in the box. They had only taken her out to take pictures, um, but Caleb was um, owned by somebody, so there wasn't a lot of wear and tear or anything on them. And the rest of mine are basically have been owned before. So, um, and I, I like it like that. Um, one of the reasons I think that I like that is because it seems like I can maybe get a little bit or better price um, for a Reborn that has already been owned by somebody. The price is a little bit lower. And I do, I'm on a dolly budget, so I have to watch a little bit how much I spend. Um, we do have one son in college and one that will be going to college in a couple years. So we do try to watch our money a little bit and I do try to check things really well. Um, if it's on eBay or Dell Fair, Fan um, or Etsy, I'm always checking to see how many dials has the person sold what is their rating on eBay? They give stars and they have feedback um, or reviews. And I always check those and try to make sure, you know, they've gotten good reviews. Um, they've been ranked or rated highly. And um, I always look at their other 
um, dials that are in their store, some of the other ones that they've done. Now, custom would be awesome. Having a custom dial made would be awesome because you'd be getting a brand new painted you know, dial. Nobody's ever messed with it or, or changed it or you know, whatever. You're going to get more of a brand new dial. But you have to wait. And that's what I'm not good at. That's where I get, you know, to the point where I'm more likely to uh, buy a dial that has already been owned by somebody else. Once I see the one that I really like and I know in my heart I feel a tug, you know, you, you get that feeling, wow, you know, that's a really cute baby. Like with him, I saw him and I was like, oh my gosh, he is amazing. He is so cute. His coloring online looked really good, but like I've said before, it tends to, it's, it's hard to tell online on the pictures that are taken and stuff, but once you get them here, usually I have had the experience that the coloring is much better once you get them home and here. And I guess right now um, he's in natural light and it is evening time. It's probably, I don't know if it's eight o'clock or something like that. So the sun's going down and stuff, but his coloring just looks awesome, his blue eyes. And once I see a baby that I'm like, you know, my heart is like tugged and pulled and, and everything, I'm like, I, I want to get that baby soon so that I can dress them and hold them and, and all that kind of stuff. So um, isn't this look guy cute? I'm going to show you up close. Woo! Woo! There he is. Yes, he is a sweetie. He's a sweetheart. So, yeah. So, I just wonder what you guys do. Do you tend to buy brand new Reborns or silicones? Ones that you custom order or wait for? Or do you buy secondhand or dolls that have already been owned by somebody else? I'm just curious. If you get a chance, um, tell me down below in the comments um, what you generally do or what you like to do and why. Now, um, we'll go ahead and get this little guy dressed. And this is a cute little light uh, blue faded jean color romper. It's got a little collar and it's got white stripes. It's got a little pocket here on the left side of his chest button down about a little bit more than halfway in the front and it says on it handsome super cool hello yay um i think that's all it says super super cool awesome so i'm gonna get this on him and i think i can just do it since there's so many buttons down the front i think i'm gonna be able to slide it on him um so yeah, just curious or what you guys generally do. I am in the market right now for another doll. My birthday is coming up and I have gone, let's see, I went on a little dolly diet for about, has it been more than a month? I know it's been at least a month. So I am kind of been wanting to look for, I've been kind of looking off and on and I'll tell you a couple of them. Chase, of course, is one that I would love to have. I think Chase is very, very cute. He's also a very hard one to get. Um, he's, a lot of people like that sculpt and um, I don't think people are getting rid of or selling their Chases very much. So it's hard to find, or they're really, really expensive. So, um, also Levi, possibly. There's some really, really good Levi's, and then there's other ones that I don't really care for. Um, let's see, what else? Ramsey, maybe. Um, oh, there's a couple others that I can't really think of right now. But he looks really cute in this. Check him out. So there he is. He's got blue eyes that match his little blue denim outfit here. He looks really cute. He's, he's going to be raring to go for Sunday. 
So that's all I had for today. I just wanted to kind of um, see what you guys were up to and see what you guys had to say, what kind of Reborns you buy, um, and silicones. I am just a Reborn mommy right now, and I don't know if I ever will get a silicone, most likely because of the cost. Um, it's just really, really expensive. We'll see. I don't know for sure. But um, you guys, oh, I wanted to do my Dove Dark Chocolate. I don't know if I have told you guys, but I love Dove Dark Chocolate. And for Mother's Day, I got two kinds. Now this is one of my favorites, the dark chocolate and peanut butter. And what I like to do is, most of all, I like to eat them. But they have these little sayings in them. And those of you that like these already know that. But I like to see what they say. So today, it says, smiles are nice, so share them. Let me put my glasses on. Oh, my gosh. I think that's what it says. Oh, that's not what it says. Smiles are free, so share them. That was from Michelle F. in Florida. I don't know if you can see that, but so, so true. Smiles are free. Let's share them with one another and make each other's day. So now that I've got this chocolate in my mouth, I'm going to stop here and I'm going to enjoy it and enjoy a little bit of time here with Mr. Ethan. So have a great day. Thank you so much for coming and visiting my channel. I would love it if you commented below on this question. And um, have a great day. We will see you really soon. Bye-bye.